Okay, hey guys, today I'm going to show you uh, my calculator I made using VBScript. So, yeah, first I'll show you the script. And, and here's the script. And, yeah, it will be in the description, so you won't need to copy this, so don't worry about that. So, yeah. And then I'll show you what happens when you click it. So, you double click it and this box will pop up okay what is the first number of your equation if you are using addition make sure to only type one digit yeah addition has a problem because my view script won't do it or something so I found a way to do it with only using one digit and then as many digits as you want so you could do this like 900 and then it would say what is the second number of your equation if you're using addition make sure to type only type in one digit so then we could do 9 and then it would say, what do you, would you want to do? Multiply, add, or subtract. And so, we'll do add, you press enter, your answer 909. So, yeah, it works if you do as many digits as you want, and then just one digit. So, yeah. And then, yeah, so, restarting calculator, it's open. And then, so, if you do 10, 10, add, then it will mess it up like your answer is 920 so 10 plus 10 isn't 920 is it so yeah that has a problem and you can fix that if you want to and then also the do you want to use the calculator again the loop thingy wouldn't work like loop and do it would mess up the script so yeah so I had to make it so it restarts if you can edit the script and do it then you that's fine but yeah if you're gonna do it without then you have to name it calculator.bbs calculator or else it won't work then yes we do want to so restarting calculator then we could do 5 5 multiply then the answer is 25 so that's pretty basic and then if you type something wrong like so say you type something like 5 like that um, it has to be a number like it has to be in number form like that so like this Okay, or else it won't work. So, because if you do that, then it will just shut down like that. You have to have it in a number form. And then if you go, so, 5, 5, and then you do something like banana. And that's not one of the thingies. So, yeah, it'll say, you have typed something wrong. Try again. Then it will shut down. So, yeah. And then once you do something, like 5, 5, then subtract, and it will work. Your answer is 0. Then, do you want to use the calculator again? click no and it'll say shutting down and it won't open it again so yeah i hope you like my video um if you have any questions please comment and that's the end and if i get an updated version then i will post it goodbye